Ladies and gentlemen, what's crock a locking? How you all are doing? In today's video, we're going to be addressing this Call of Duty thing that's going on right now and people's accounts being hacked and stuff while playing Cold War, Modern Warfare 2, and things like that. But first thing I really want to get into here, I want to address my video sponsor, which is MitchCactus.com. Now, listen, you guys, they do not sell hacks, they do not sell cheats. So when I talk about hacks and cheats, I'm saying like aim bots, uh, things that are going to help you guys get the advantage against other players and multiplayer and stuff like that. So aim bot, wall hacks, uh, cheats like that, you guys, they do not uh, sell that stuff. So with that being said, if you guys are wanting to play in bot lobbies or maybe you want that nuke skin or you just can't wait to unlock those camos, then you guys need to check out MitchCactus.com for sure, you guys. So like things, if you guys don't have time and stuff like that to unlock camos, uh, maybe you guys want certain skins and stuff like that. That's what they offer you guys. They got amazing reviews over on Trustpilot and you got, you're not going to find a better deal anywhere else. Definitely go check them out. Link's going to be in the description below. All right, so going back into May here, Charlie Intel tweeted, there is currently an exploit in Black Ops Cold War on all platforms where a person can gain access to a player's IP crash their game or potentially cause other issues no indication so far of it happening in modern warfare 2 or warzone 2 activision has not addressed this nor have they stated that they're aware of the problem would be best to avoid cold war till fixed now today roughly about 21 hours ago a rah rah here on twitter uh you can now be attacked by cheaters on warzone 2 modern warfare 2 the same as cold war your account can be perma banned by cheaters this is what the process looks like a Warzone 2, Modern Warfare 2, Cold War. Crossplay off does not save you even on console. So this is definitely a big issue here, you guys. I am showing on screen right now what the cheat actually looks like. And again, like with my with my video sponsors, guys, MitchCactus.com, they do not sell anything like this, nor do they condone it. Now on June 5th here, we had another tweet from Charlie Intel as continued PSA. Do not play Black Ops Cold War on any platforms as hackers can still get your IP and crash the game. This is happening in any mode and on all platforms. Activision still has not said anything about this. So getting into Lurgware here, about 20 hours ago, Charlie Intel tweeted, Activision Blizzard has sent a cease and desist to Lurgware. I, I'm not sure if I'm saying that right. I don't really care, but the person behind the attacks on Black Ops Cold War not clear if this means the game is safe to play, but the person who was exploiting the IP hack crashing the game has shut down their hack tool. Now, Call of Duty has opened up a new account here on Twitter called Call of Duty Updates. And this one here states, and this was about 19 hours ago, we're aware of the recent reports regarding exploits on Black Ops Cold War that impact the small population of players across all platforms. Investigations with partners began last week and are ongoing which is a really, really good thing here. I mean, hopefully, I mean, they're not really going to be able to fix it, you guys. These hackers are constantly going to be able to do this. So with all that being said, I really think that these hackers and stuff are working more towards like uh, larger streamers, uh, people who are actually streaming and stuff on Twitch and here on YouTube. I mean, I think they're actually going against more of those people. So is it safe for you guys to play these games? not a hundred percent safe but i mean the chances of this happening to you guys are probably like maybe 50 percent, maybe half i don't know it's it's totally up to you guys whether you guys want to play it play it at your own discretion uh modern warfare 2 uh modern warfare warzone 2 here black ops cold war i mean i've been playing cold war here in solo so i think maybe if you guys are playing in solo it's definitely a lot better as for like console players and stuff if you guys could play offline that would probably be your best bet and I think like another thing here is the PC players are probably more at risk. But again, guys, playing in solo mode, uh, not playing multiplayer and stuff like that would probably be your guys' best bet. Uh, just keep a lookout, you guys. I mean, there's really no way around it. We don't really want to stop playing these games. But if we have to, I mean, I will definitely stop playing if, if things get too worse here. Uh, but yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, hopefully you enjoyed the glitches you guys were seeing on screen here in Black Ops Cold War Zombies. I will be coming out with another uh, video here today on all working glitches here on the map Forsaken. So stay tuned for that. Uh, don't forget to smash that like button to keep my algorithm real. Subscribe with that bell notification on so you don't miss any of my awesome, excellent videos. Get in the game, glitch something out, have some fun. 
Until next time, I'm the Puff Man. Peace out.